When building an outside radius curve, begin by calculating the radius of the top course. This will be the smallest radius in the wall, and it must never be less than the minimum radius for the block system used. A rule of thumb used to calculate the approximate radius of the top course is this. Add one quarter inch to the setback of the block used. Multiply that amount by the number of courses in the finished wall. Then subtract the result from the radius of the base course. This number equals the calculated radius of the top course. Here's an example. The setback of Highland Stone is 1 and 1 eighths inches. The wall is 8 courses high. The radius of the base course is 6 feet. Let's plug in the numbers. 1 and 1 eighths inches plus 1 quarter inch equals 1 and 3 eighths inches. Multiplied by 8 courses equals 11 inches. 6 feet minus 11 inches equals 5 feet 1 inch, which is the calculated radius of the top course. To establish the base course, drive a stake into the ground at the desired center of the curve. Attach a string and rotate it to mark the radius in the soil. Dig the trench based on this radius and build a base course using best practices. Remove the lip and align the back of the block with the radius curve level side to side and front to back. On additional courses, the lip of each block must contact the back of the units below to ensure structural stability. Setback will cause the radius of each course to gradually decrease.